Warm greetings to you, ladies and gentlemen. This is Mascom Studies uh, presenting again on another video. This is uh, Maslow's hierarchy of needs. All right, the basic concept of human needs. All right, uh, this concept uh, was um, the father of this concept was Maslow, uh, Abraham Maslow. Uh, he identified uh, the five needs in a worker. They can be applied in different fields, but the study that was done by Abraham Maslow was mainly on the needs of a worker. All right? So he identified that a worker has five needs. The first basic or primary need of a worker is the physical needs. Right? Under physical needs, uh, Maslow identified that there is needy. Uh, a human being is needy for food, is needy for shelter, is needy for rest. And usually money satisfy all these physical needs. Right? And also he identified that a worker after meeting the, 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 phys, uh, the physiological needs or the physical needs moves to a higher order need. Okay? To a higher order need which we call uh, the safety need which you call the what the safety need right under safety need the worker in this case is mainly concerned about job security safety at work health and safety issues at work all right then also must identify that a worker has what we call social needs social needs this is a desire in a worker to make friends to meet different people in different times all right so a worker has this need so after safety needs have been met the worker moves on to a higher order need which is the social needs then Maslow also said no the worker often moves to a higher order need which he termed the esteem need a worker has esteem needs that is the desire by worker to be recognized, to be respected by others, to have a status in a, at a workplace or in a society. Then the last order, uh, that uh, the, the higher order need that he identify, uh, identified was self-actualization. This is reaching one's full potential. So these are basically the five needs that were identified by Abraham Maslow. Okay? So as a manager, you need to understand. We remember our last video is, was why people work. Usually, it's these needs that drive workers to work in order to meet these what needs. So work has to be crafted wisely in such a way that it can also meet the workers' needs at the same time uh, meeting the organizational goals okay let's move on to the acronym that i have produced for you for you to remember the five needs of workers p s s e s p s s e s okay p standing for our first p uh in this one we have got the, the p standing for the physical need all right our physical needs as i have highlighted this is the basic need of a worker okay he I, must identify that a worker is what is a primary objective his main objective of a worker the primary objective is to meet his or her physical needs such as shelter food clothes etc that is the basic need but then the question is not about learning the theory it's about application how do we apply this again into the 21st century modern businesses you are the entrepreneur and you are watching me live i know that it's necessary then after identifying that the workers have physical needs the physiological needs there is needed also to apply blessed are those who hear the word and do it so application is also critical. So how do you, how do you apply this as a manager? Managers should pro, provide, all right. It should be provide adequate 
salaries should provide adequate salaries to meet employees basic needs usually your salary as a manager is the salary of workers as a manager is guided by the company policy and it should be adequate enough to meet the workers basic needs that we have identified in the previous slides all right the need and the application let's move on to uh, the other part of this acronym the s the safety needs a worker we agreed on the uh, hierarchy that a worker has safety needs under this when physical needs have been met we are agreeing when physical needs have been met a worker moves to a higher order need which is the word the safety need at this level the worker is looking forward to job security and also a healthy and a safe working environment okay how do we apply this as a manager as a manager to apply this is very simple manager should offer contracts to workers and give protective clothing like in this situation in this scenario the modern scenario that we are faced with, there is covid 19 there is need of sanitizer there is need of uh, the the the, the uh, mask there is need also of the of all the clothing um that can protect the worker from uh, con uh, con uh being contaminated by the this virus so as a manager you should offer should give protective clothing and you should not expose your workers to a harmful working environment so a clean and safe environment is a critical at this point let's move on to the third need that is the social need this one is a very simple one after meeting the security need after remember it's after then the worker moves also to a higher order need which at this stage is the social need the employee in this case tries to make friends and to affiliate to a social group okay he's trying the he or she is trying to gain what acceptance in this case at a workplace so how do you apply this application is very critical in this video i emphasize on application there is need to promote teamwork as a manager you should promote or as the employer or the entrepreneur should promote teamwork and group work why this uh, to ensure that every worker is what is involved and this will promote a sense of belongingness at the enterprise let's move on to uh, this other need the fourth need which is the esteem need this one is a very simple one in this case the worker is a need to earn respect all right it needs also to be recognized but this one is simple how do you apply it as a manager as a manager in this case you are supposed to praise every good work you must give credit to every achievement that he has been made all right let's move on to the last need that we have identified uh in this hierarchy of need the self actualization this is the highest level or the high highest order need all right this is a sense uh, the, uh this level is about reaching one's full potential reaching one's full potential and having a sense of what achievement so how do you apply this one manage management should give workforce challenging work that is stimulate or that is stimulates an employee to stretch him or herself or that offers an opportunity for the worker to grow all right let's move on to the limitations this has its challenges money he identified this is at the first order need but money can also meet other needs right Maslow also assumed that workers have got the same what needs but workers have got different needs you also assumed that this level is reached but it's not possible all right i think this is easy for us you can contact me on the uh, details i encourage you to subscribe to my youtube video for more video i will be moving on to taylor c theory again that i will explain so keep uh 
on 